hey my pretties welcome back to my channel so today's video i have a dollar tree haul i did pick up a few things while i was in the store from when i was filming and showing you guys as i was walking around i picked up a couple things so i figured i would just show you guys what came home with me uh these first two items i went to the store i think it was yesterday or the day before i didn't film i just needed to run in and get some styrofoam cups and I saw these and so I picked them up so I didn't actually show these during a walkthrough but I found the Pond's Facial Foam Pure Detox um, little stuff and it's a uh, 1.7 fluid ounces I call it stuff uh, and then I saw this Pond's Perfect Color Complex Anti Mark for Natural Color and this one the only thing when i was reading on the side it said to try to use it with the ponds perfect color complex facial foam but you only get this one inside of dollar tree um so i don't know but i think it'll be fine if you don't use it with the other product you can just use it by itself so i did pick up these two then from bolero i picked up the three facial washes i did also pick up the face wipes but those are in the bathroom and i completely forgot to bring them in here and show you but i always get the bolero face wipes i like them a lot this i'm going to try out i was uh, more excited to smell them and see what they smell like uh so yeah and this one is hydrating the coconut and rose hip the soothing this one the black tea and lychee is soothing and then the strawberry and pineapple is brightening so i just want to give them a try to see what they smell like um i haven't opened them yet they are sealed shut uh this one has a white thing but they do have the the silver like foil stuff still over them so i haven't opened those then i got one of the suave did i get both yeah i picked up both of the suave lotions the advanced therapy lotion uh just this one didn't have a fragrance but this one was the coco shea and these will be perfect for me to put in one in my purse and give one to my daughter so she can keep in her backpack for school or what whatnot and then two more of the well three more of the beauty products i did get the coconut oil this is manufactured by blue crop blue cross laboratories so i wanted to just go ahead and give it a try it's just some oil and then the dermacil eczema relief moisturizing lotion i went ahead and picked up one of those um sometimes when especially like right now with the winter the the air will have my skin a little bit dry so i'm not going to use this alone i was thinking about maybe putting some in my hand with my normal lotion and mixing it together and see if that'll help with um, I don't get dry patches, but you know, sometimes you just feel like your skin is dry. So I just wanted to try this out. So I got that. And then I did get a pack of the Allure Pure, uh, Pore Clarifying Wipes with Witch Hazel. I did open these. I did try one out. And what I will say is I like them because the thing, the sheet is really like thick and durable like that. Um, they don't really smell like... They don't really smell like anything but i do like that they were nice and thick and they're moisturizing not too wet but not too dry so i think these will be pretty cool and the last beauty items that i picked up was some kiss nail polish i always get these whenever i see them i pretty much have most of the colors that have popped up in dollar tree i did get this real pretty greenish blue color um i always get the clear i'm actually wearing the clear today I love it because it's like a gel it says gel shine so for a dollar this is definitely good love that one and then I also picked up these two it's like a gold and a light like metallic kind of pearl pink kind of like that and so I picked up those four uh, I did get another pair of these fur flip-flops that are really really good to use either after you get out the shower um, but I like to take them to like for pedicures and stuff like that. So I just picked up the black pair of these. Even though Christmas has passed, I did not see this fragrance around that time. Or maybe I just did, you know, maybe it was there and I didn't see it. But Hot Cocoa and Cream is one of my favorite fragrances from Bath and Body Works around Christmas. So this one is the Hot Cocoa and Cream in the uh, Mason Jar, the Old Williamsburg. And so it's it smells a little bit like hot cocoa and cream but i just bought that just to give it a try i want to burn it and see if i'm gonna like it 
Also, I got these two incense holders like that. And they have, this one has, is that like a sun right here, a gold sun and a moon right there. And they're just your basic incense holders besides burning candles. Um, I have diffusers. I have a few things. I like the house to continuously smell like stuff. But every now and then, I do like to burn incense. That's what I used to burn before I got hooked on candles from Bath and Body Works. Um, always had candle. I mean, um, incense in my house. So um, I picked up those two. And then I've never really purchased or really tried incense from the Dollar Tree. So I picked up the vanilla just to give them a try and see if I'm going to like it. I don't know. I'm actually going to burn these today and see how they are. But you get 40 of them in a pack. In the craft section, they have these cute light-up boxes that are wood that you can stain, paint, do whatever you want. Uh, they have the little thing in the back for you to turn it on and off. So I got the pineapple. I got the cute little porcupine or hedgehog, whatever he is. I think he's a porcupine. Like that really cute and they look like that you can let the kids paint those and decorate them and create whatever however they want to paint them or whatever and let it let it be theirs i think that'll be a cute little project and then i also got the butterfly really nice and all of them light up so i picked up those three they had these in the past i love post-it notes sticky notes all of those notes i go through them so fast so I saw these again, which was, like I said, they're way in the past that I remember. And it's the waffle and the syrup one. And then this one is a sun and a rain cloud. So I picked up both of those. I do already have some lemons that I picked up in the past from Dollar Tree. However, those were in the box with different fruits and you would get one lemon for a dollar. I think this is a good deal for you to get three for a dollar. So I picked these up to use as vase filler um, somewhere in the kitchen. I think I know exactly where I'm going to put these at, but I picked these up for that purpose. And yeah, I am on the hunt for a few more of these. I really like these flowers. So there is five of them and they just look like that. I have been seeing purple since I since I found these I've been seeing purple I have yet to find any more of these white ones and they come on the long stick like that um, that's the name of them hopefully that is not blurry let me see right there that's the name of these and they are really really nice and I have an arrangement by my front door with some purple flowers in there. So I'm thinking about standing those behind the purple ones. We'll see how they look. But I just think these are really nice for a dollar. And so I picked up five of those. I forgot to show you guys these. The hot and cold iPads. Um, the little kiwi. They look like kiwi to me. You can use these hot or cold. Um, they do say you can pop them in the microwave for like five seconds or three seconds or something like that. I think we did it say three to five something like that do not exceed 10 seconds but what i would probably do is just submerge them in a sink full of warm water so that they're not too hot as i put them on my eye because lord <laughs> can you guys imagine i start my video off and i got a black ring i mean like a red ring around my eye from these ipads so um i'll probably just put them in warm water whenever my eyes is feeling a little puffy or whatever and just use those for that uh, I don't think I'm going to put them in the microwave. But then I picked up some more eggs. Uh, in one of my previous hauls, I did pick up some eggs for Easter. But these were the ones that have the little things that you can hang. So I picked up a set of those. How many is in there? 12 of them. We are almost done, you guys. Okay, so I picked up some really pretty Valentine's Day tissue paper. I picked up two packs of this one and this one with the gold hearts on it and i got these because i keep saying it over and over and over again i need to start listing in my poshmark i have been slacking on my poshmark and i have a bunch of stuff to put in there um so i i'm planning my mind is saying post on poshmark so whenever somebody purchases something i like to use tissue paper in my packages and since valentine's is coming up i just got these to go in my packages 
Uh, I saw this car visor tissue kit. This was actually in Dollar Tree a few years back. I want to say like two or three years ago. And I don't even know what happened to my other one. But it disappeared. And so I picked up another one. And it's just a little visor thing. And it's good to keep because, you know, when you have kids, you might want to just need, you might just need to grab a tissue. And so these come in handy for that purpose. So I picked up those. Here's um, some ribbon two of the heart shaped I don't know what I'm gonna do with these I was thinking about using them as part of my tablescape I don't know I don't know but these are the wired ribbons so I picked these up just to kind of mess with not too sure what I'm gonna do with those I got two of the door hangers I love these things I got the darker pink and then light pink with the white here is some scarves the infinity scarves this one with the cute little hearts on it and if i don't wear it around my neck um i can always use these as a scarf on my head you guys know you know tie it in the front or whatever even though it's an infinity scarf it'll still work and then i also picked up this one that you guys have seen with the little tassels on the end uh with the hearts on that one and then i got two of the bandanas two sets they're two different ones I like both of these on the outside and then you get the checkered right here uh, then they had some just for me t-shirts every now and then Dollar Tree likes to throw in some cute shirts and stuff like that uh, this is actually a 1x and it's just a pink uh, v-neck shirt and it has a little foil flower on the front and I just thought it was kind of cute to pick up for a dollar. Uh, it does still have the little tag on the inside. It says just for me. And I've seen a lot of shirts. They had all the way up to, I think they had up to a 4X at this store. So, yeah. I got the cute little frog with the little lip. Um, and I'm going to give this to Pooh Bear. So, I got that for him. I did pick up a pair of these little St. Patrick's Day socks. They had a few... <laughs> <laughs> they had a <laughs> when I said I'm gonna give this to Pooh Bear he just popped up you guys should have saw that that was funny you so silly boy uh, these St. Patrick's Day socks I only picked up this one pair they're really really soft I think they're cute as well as some St. Patrick's Day novelty glasses these <laughs> I don't know why I picked those up but I did and then the last couple things was this Whitman solid heart chocolates. So one for each one of my young ones when it when I do their basket. I'll I'll do that. I got these for me. I love me some truffles. I don't like white chocolate, so the white chocolate ones in this one will get picked out. Uh but I believe it comes with seven in here. So I got those and then I got these and these are always in Dollar Tree but I just felt like when I was in the store I was like I want some truffles so I picked them up and you get four of them in there. And then these are some sandwich bags and snack bags. The Lion King ones are snack and these are sandwich bags Toy Story and I will be using these to send Pooh Bear snack and stuff with him to school. The last two items I picked up were cookbooks one of them is the pressure cooker cookbook and i got this for my mom my mom loves to cook with a pressure cooker so i got her that and they have some really nice things in there like green chili and tomatillo is it tomatillo carnitas so different things in there that, that you can cook so it's for pressure cooker and then this one america the great cookbook the food we make for the people we love from a hundred of our finest chefs and food heroes look at how big that book is this book is big and it says retailed for forty dollars so i don't know my son loves to cook oh okay so it shows you who it is the person is and then it shows their recipe navel orange marmalade spring stew with halibut like all kinds of different all kinds of different stuff in here so yeah i picked that up for my son so he can take a look at it because i like for him to get different ideas of stuff and then um that way he can go cook <laughs> that way i can try it 
so i picked that up for him and that is it for today's dollar tree haul i hope you guys enjoyed this and i'll talk to you real soon in my next video bye